And good afternoon. This is Admiral Preparedness here on day eight of our 21 days of eating only MREs. Today we're having beef strips as the entree and the side will be fried rice. Obviously it's not here right now because it's in the kitchen getting heated by the boiling water. Uh, we're not going to have anything else with that other than that because that's pretty much filling as it is. This is going to be a uh, uh, just a short review of the items. Uh, I'm not going to sit and eat them while you're watching. That's not what we're here for. We're here to let you guys know that I'm in a program right now which is all voluntary by the uh, U.S. Army Natick Labs in Massachusetts where we're going to spend the next few more days only eating MREs and that's only eating MREs. The government has set up a program right now where volunteers can come in as long as they're you know properly vetted. Uh, we'll be given uh, three meals a, a, at a time. Uh, we take the meals back if what's not eaten uh, does not get calculated into our caloric intake. Right now I'm at 2600 calories per day. I'm not gaining weight and I'm not losing weight. Uh, my activity is, is what it was before the program started. I'm to re remain in that activity level for the entire period that the uh, uh, study is conducted for myself. <clears throat> it's interesting to note that uh, nothing's changed. I, I feel great. There's no sluggishness. Uh, the the uh, daily activities are the same. Uh, biologically, I, I feel fantastic. Uh, the meat the beverages, the food, the sides, the desserts are all spot on. I've, I've accustomed myself now to uh, eating about every couple hours uh, something to snack on. They've got, they get plenty of snacks for you. Uh, peanut butter. Uh, there's uh, an interesting combination of items they sh they choose per MRE. But with a, a two day window, you're allowed to play with those meals. That's four packages uh, within that two day period. So there's always something you can mix and match. Uh, the only thing I don't eat are the uh, I don't chew the gum or use the salt. Everything else I consume. Uh, the beverages, uh, there's only two beverages, well, one type of beverage which is the electrolyte uh, style um, Gatorade type dry uh, mix where uh, I use cold water to put everything in and it doesn't like cold water whatsoever. It takes forever for it to, to dissolve in cold water. Basically what it forms is a coagulated lump at the bottom of the, of the cup and after about a half an hour, 45 minutes at uh, room temperature it finally dissolves. That's okay, but I could do without it. The other items are uh, cocoa beverage. Uh, they do give you a, a, like a latte. Uh, they give you coffee, uh, cream sugar, substitute sugar. Uh, my favorite dessert now has to be the the uh, the, the the cakes. Uh, the snack breads are di are different. Uh, you only give you one piece of bread, sort of. It's like a dense a dense bread type material. We'll go we'll go over those a little later. Once we get closer to the end of review, we'll give a, we'll give a full detail of those different types of snacks. But for right now, we're basically just trying to get you folks to understand it. This is a 21-day eating-only MREs, uh, a 24-hour period per MRE packet. There's two packages per, and right now we're going to go check on our meal, and I'll be right back. And with the magic of electronics, we have our meals set out here now. We have the beef strips, and then we have the fried rice. Uh, they come with the zipper bag on the top, so this is easily nice to be able to do. I usually have to use scissors if it's not on my way that I really want to open it. Uh, you can see from the inside that it's very, very flavorful and smells great. I can smell the spices. Uh, you can obviously see that there's large chunks of the meat. Again, uh, everything's supposed to come out as is of the container. There's no waste. The fried rice going to look a little different than what you've seen before. It's not something that, uh, you know, fried rice looks like when you buy it at the, and then you cook it in your home. This is going to be a condensed form uh, for the uh, user to enjoy. Uh, one thing about the fried rice is going to be compact, so it's going to look like a pasty type material. As you can see here, it's uh, it's been, you know, it's compressed. But, you know, once you stir it up, it'll be edible. And, uh, again, it comes right out of the container like it's prescribed and designed to do. There's a little bit in the corner there. We'll, we'll get some of those little nutri those little goodies out of there. We're not letting any of this go to waste. Uh, eat it all. I have yet to, to not eat something in this 
ammo uh, program. Uh, what's nice about the uh, rice is this full, full white rice. Uh, it's got a uh, like a sauce or a light paste mixed with it. If you like your food spicy, they do offer some spices. Uh, I don't particularly like spices myself, but I'll eat them occasionally. And this is the the rice, uh, it's fried rice. Very good in flavor. Uh, the, the the rice texture is I would consider well done. Um, yeah, well done. It's almost a, almost turned into a paste, but it still has its form. Very tasteful, very tasty. The beef, once again, is um, as you can see, it's uh, very very not processed more like a brisket i see um all these different ingredients i think those are bam uh, yeah bamboo this is asian so these two go together very well go together nice and flavorful mix up a little of the rice and the the beef Mm, definitely, definitely something I'm going to ask for again if I'm allowed to. I like the entree and I like the side dish. They go well together. So, I'm going to sit down and eat this. We'll talk to you guys soon.